All right, no high beam or low. I think that's low beam. Yeah, no low beam. Driver's side, 2012 uh, Chevy Malibu. Um, supposed to take the whole front on off, front end off to get it. I'm going to show you a quicker and faster way. All right, so you got a couple screws to remove and a lot of uh, plastic buttons. You got one, two, three, and then you have uh, this one here, four, one up top, five, and then um, this is a, sorry, this one here is a screw. I believe it's a six millimeter, another six millimeter, and then you have a bunch of tabs on the bottom here. We're on a lift, so it's easy to see. Uh, one, two, three um you can leave uh this bracket uh the little uh shield on and then this whole thing will fall out once it falls out uh, i have the wheel cock to the left hand side um and i'm going to push this and just shove it in, in there but here's what you're trying to change is uh where these wires go right here that is your light bulb uh there is just enough room in there and i got uh, pretty fat hands that i'm able to squeeze my hands in there turn it um it's a clockwise to the left a uh, quarter turn, it pops out, bring it down uh, to disconnect wires, change it, and put it back up. Uh, you probably could bend, uh, it's a bit of a tight squeeze, you could probably bend this bracket here, which I'm actually considering doing on this time. This is like the third time we've replaced this bulb. Uh, your hand gets kind of nicked up, but that is exactly where it goes. Uh, right where those black and yellow wires are, that's to that uh, low beam bulb, and it goes right there. The technical procedure for this is you're supposed to take off the entire front bumper. Uh, as you can see by those bolts and brackets, it would be a giant pain in the ass. Uh, probably a couple hour job. I have this thing to this point in, well, I'm on a, I'm on a lift, but about 15, I don't know, not even 15 minutes, probably five minutes. Um, and if you were on the ground, uh, I actually had my lift set low because you need to be able to reach your hand up approximately a foot and a half to, you know, to, to get to it. Uh, if you were laying on the ground, it would still be uh, imperfect. The only thing you have a problem with is uh, tucking this bad boy out of the way. Um, but all I do is, like I said, I fold it back into the wheel well there, even pull it around the other side of the wheel well, and then go from there. I'll show you. All right, so um, obviously here's your bulb. Uh, you can go ahead and disconnect it right there, but I just wanted to show you the back of uh, the opening there, which you can see right, I'm gonna use the bolt to point there. That's where it goes in, uh, It's a, it basically this points straight down, rotate it a quarter turn uh, to the left. Uh, getting it out is easy, getting it back in is a little bit harder, but now we're going to uh, pull these two clips, one, two, actually I can probably do it one-handed, and, uh, and then replace the bulb, put it back in, reverse order. All right, guys, so I uh, got it in there. Had a little more trouble with this one. As you can see, straight up and down is the lock position. Uh, if you turn that 30 degrees to the left, it comes out real easy. Put it in the exact same way. Um, and then uh, the hardest part is get the three tabs. Really helps you have somebody else looking at it to make sure it's flush before you turn it. You don't want to break any of those little tabs or anything. Um, but it's the hardest part is that you have to reach in here on the right side and somehow pull it down. Uh, I just shove my fingers up there. It hurts, but um, that's the easiest way to get it without taking any bumper off, anything like that. Uh, if you did want to take the bumper off, uh, you'd have to pull these panels anyway, pull those two bolts, and this cover would come off, and then go underneath the hood and do everything else uh, for the, the so now you're gonna take it off, put it back together. Um, and once you put it back together, test it out. All right guys, so the reason this is so difficult is those three tabs right there, one, two, and third on the other side. Um, and as you can see, they go up against some bump stops there. Uh, but get it in there, turn it right, and hopefully it works. Try it out. And there we go. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks guys.